Hey everyone, it's Eric Yo with Nintendo 3DS Friend Codes, and um, today we're gonna play Scribble Knots Unlimited. We're gonna do the first couple minutes on this here, so we can go ahead and take a look. Now, mind you, I haven't played this game yet myself, so um, it should be an interesting experience to go ahead and check this new game out. But uh, let's go ahead and get started, shall we? Now, also, mind you, I've never played a Scribble Notes Unlimited game ever. Period. Uh, this or a Scribble Notes game at all. So, um, you guys are gonna have to bear with me while I walk through. I'm sure there's some kind of walkthrough or tutorial at the beginning, but nevertheless, this will be my first time. So, <clears throat> now there's a storyline. I'll make sure to be quiet during that time. Uh, let's go ahead and mess with the options first. I'm gonna have the TV off. Since I'm gonna be playing on the gamepad. Alright, so let's go ahead and start this. Our story begins with Grandpa Edgar and Grandma Julie. You might not believe this, but Grandpa Edgar used to be the world's greatest adventurer. Grandma Julie would beg to differ. She was also an adventurer. Edgar would often brush away vines or open doors, thought to be undisturbed for generations, only to find Julie was already there, having lunch. They competed like this on adventure after adventure. On one adventure, Julie beat Edgar to the top of the long-lost pyramid. But the treasure she found was an engagement ring. Aww. The two of them <laughs> semi-retired to start a family, and they continued starting that family until they had 42 children. One day, Mom and Dad gave Maxwell and me two amazing gifts. The first was a magic globe that let you travel <laughs> anywhere in the world. The second was the most amazing notebook. This notebook let you write any word in it. Poof! would come to life. Our parents were worried about us turning out to be spoiled little brats, so they sent us out to face the challenges of the outside world. Yeah, you're pretty spoiled. On the road spoiled. to the city, we <coughs> ran into an old man who said he was hungry. Maxwell made something to give him. But he played a nasty trick. Oh, the apple was rotten. Oh, the old man spat it out as soon as he tasted it and was very, very angry. As he cast some sort of magic, he called us spoiled little kids and then disappeared. It didn't seem like anything had happened. But when Maxwell turned to continue down the road, I couldn't follow him. The old man had put a curse on me that was turning me to stone. We didn't know what to do. Luckily, our brother Edwin's farm was nearby. Boy, you should have seen how angry Edwin was. He couldn't believe what we did to the old man and said we probably deserved what we got. Whoa. Uh -oh. That's strange. It was a little dirty. So let me go ahead and pop it back in. <coughs> Sorry about that, guys. Didn't expect that to happen. Oh. Our store. I'm skipping it. <laughs> I didn't want to start that over. Sorry about that, guys. I really did not see that coming. So, um, here's the game. Alright. Oh, I can use the stylus. Wow, a game that uses a stylus. Yeah, it does. Awesome. And it's Star Star Ride by helping Edwin with his award winning pig. <clears throat> Alright, the basics. Turn the runt of the litter into an award winning pig. Ride an object to help Maxwell scrub the pig. All right, so the brush, oops, let me go back. 
uh, the uh, on my gamepad screen, <clears throat> the brush is up here on the top in the corner. So I'm going to click over here, or to bring up not the brush, excuse me, the notepad. That's what I'm going to go ahead and type in is the brush. Brush uh, for cleaning. So I, I'll drag it to Maxwell. Use the object to clean the pig. Tab the progress bar for the current tint. Tab Maxwell to remove this object. Well, he just litters it. Drag it to the trash. So the trash can is over on my right hand corner too, over here. The pig looks right now. Use an objective, <coughs> excuse me, adjective to increase the pig's size. Uh. What the hell? I don't know what to write. Uh. I'm just gonna write bro. Help the pig win the talent competition. Uh, okay. I need wings. So, can you give him wings? Alright. <laughs> Huge wings. Wait, how do I give it to him? Drag these to the magic backpack. Oh, there's a magic backpack up here in the top left corner. <clears throat> Take the wings from the magic backpack that I just put away. Oh. Now drag the wings to the pig. Oh, look at it go. Blah, 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 blah. Mm -hmm. Aha. That's reminding me of The Sims. Yay. The pig won by cheating. So is that mine or what? Yes it is. Pick up. <coughs> the basics have been completed. Turn shards <clears throat> by helping people ten shards will Form a star right, use star right vision to find sharks. Okay. Tap the golden object for hints. Help the sprout grow. So how do I get out of it? Oh. Uh, fertilizer? Uh, yeah, right? Ah, look at that. No? Not the right thing? Oh, wait. Oh, shoot. <laughs> um, I need something. The plant scared away the other shard opportunity. Reset the level to return to the object's original state. Tap the plus sign. Reset. Save your progress. <coughs> was that part of the tutorial or was that a. No, it was part of the tutorial. Well, the notepad can create many things. Uh, vulgarity, copyrighted materials, and pronouns are not allowed. Proper nouns, excuse me. What the wrong with you? Is that a star right opportunity? Yeah, it is. My kitty is stuck on top of the tree. Get her for me. Well, you could have been nicer about it, but okay. Uh, ladder? No, wait. Link. Link, help us out. Get the cat. Oh, you suck. <clears throat> Ladder. Link, go get the cat. Now. Oh, dude.
Uh, up. Upper. Pick it up. Pick up the cat. Oh, don't pet the cat. Pick it up. Ugh. Climb it. <clears throat> Let's throw this away. Pick up the cat. Parachute. All right, cat. There you go. Here's your cat. <coughs> I guess that works. And I completed the level and I didn't get my star shard. Learning from the basics was just the first step towards saving Lily. Use the bus stop to begin your journey in the capital city. Where's the bus stop? Okay. Well, this is an interesting game, but, uh, oh wait, no, I don't want to do this again. No! But this isn't my, uh, my cup of tea, so to speak. Uh, it's a pretty cool game, I guess, for, I don't know, I just, I'm not, I'm not really fond of this game, to be honest with you not catching my attention <coughs> but I thought I'd give it a shot so I could show everybody else about this Mario <coughs> excuse me well, I guess I want to need oops I don't know why I'm having to do this again can I leave now But, um, well, I guess I hope everybody enjoyed it and uh, this gave you, got, uh, you know, you guys uh, an opportunity to go ahead and uh, pick up the game, but I'm not very uh, <coughs> fond of the game myself, personally, but like I said, if you guys like it, then that's cool. Just going to keep playing until the end of the, another two minutes here. <coughs> New wings, create an object, huge wings. Let's put in the backpack. <coughs> Excuse me. Trying to get over a cold here at the same time. Put wings on the pig, pig flies. Blah 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 blah. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video <clears throat> uh, keep uh, subscribe to my channel and you'll go ahead and see more videos in the future uh, for other games such as uh, my next video is going to be for Super Mario Bros. U and I also have Nintendo Land that I'm going to go ahead and uh, do a couple of uh, little video on as well. And any other future games that are major hits, I'm going to go ahead and uh, get those two later down the road. But uh, thanks for watching, guys. I'm um, just going to go ahead and do one last thing here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mario. Okay. Well, guys, thanks again for watching. Uh, we'll see you on the next video. Bye now.